Guten Tag. It is I, the one and only human. Um, I hope you liked my sexy horse guitar solo. It was very cool. I spent a quote unquote lot of time working on it. Yeah. Uh, I was just bored and I decided to do it. That, um, horse mask was my Halloween costume in like three years ago, I think. Or two years ago. I don't remember. By the way, this guy needs to go away. And core guns. Whoa, oh, what? Haha. <laughs> okay, anyways, so what I wanted to talk about today was how an entire billion people were represented by uh, the flag of one country that is just a couple million at the most. So at my school, and uh, at many schools in the United of A, America. They have these things called multicultural nights at the schools. And practically, uh, they're like, okay, hello. Many different types of people live in our, live, go to our schools. You wanna know what would be cool? If, uh, for one night of the year, we invited them to share their, we invited them to sh share their nationalities and their culture and stuff. I mean, wouldn't that be cool? So, like, so we can learn more about people who aren't us. And like, yeah, that's cool. It's a pretty fun thing. Free food. Always a plus. Uh, and... But, oh god. <laughs> Did they do an oopsie? Like, uh, I think it was the ASB. The as Associated Student Body. Which was in charge of doing the organizations. This was in ninth grade uh, last year. Yeah. Oh no. Please go away. <laughs> yeah, okay, that, that's a cool concept, but the ASB in there, Infinite Wisdom, the poster outside the cafeteria that advertised the. Parade of Nations, it was called at our school, had one African country. Bruh, 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 African country's flag on it, which, okay, that's cool. Sure, there's not many people from Africa that live in the United States and it's not as if they're a minority and we need to be more accepted of them and there were like five Asian countries no but fine one African country that's cool but it was Guinea-Bissau Hello, humans. I don't think anybody... Like, WTF, I was probably one of the only, like, ten people out of a school of thousands who knew that was the flag of Guinea-Bissau. Like, how... What? L did you search up, like, African flags? And you came up with Guinea-Bissau? Like, come on. Use Egypt. Ethiopia. South Africa. Any anything other than Guinea Bissau. Like oh my god, what is your logic? And any Oh no. Anyways Bruh. Whoa, hello there. Mr. Flyman. That's very cool of you. Thank you. <laughs> he died. Nice.
I love it. <laughs> that guy was the most good-darted hacker in the world. Yeah. I'm just gonna take this chest. Come on, leave me alone. Oh my god. Okay, so... In this... <laughs> the... I don't get... How do you come up with a flag of Guinea-Bissau? Did you mistake it for a flag of another country that also uses the colors um, red, green, and gold to symbolize their like their flag? Many African countries have those colors on their flags, such as Mali or Guinea or Guinea-Bissau. Okay. <sighs> okay, that's a possibility. But please put in more effort when designing your posters and not just search African flag. Or maybe they thought Guinea Bissau. Wait, shoot. Maybe they thought Guinea Bissau was a big country with a lot of people. Which I'm still not sure is that is the case. So I th I'm, I'm just gonna leave it up to ignorance on their behalf for just. I, I don't get it. Well, I mean, I got very mad. All of my friends were like, bruh, shut up, it's just a poster. But I don't care. You don't understand me. Eek! It's just gonna be a compilation of me falling into the void. But I still don't get how... The ASB is just stupid. The only pe the only reason people join ASB is for college credits and to have it be on your resume. But other than that, who cares? Who cares? I don't. Oh yeah, here's another thing. I don't get school pride. I get nationalistic pride, as in pride for your country, proud that you are this culture. That's cool, because it's literally in your blood. Uh, but it's just a school, like, man. Like, there's kids, like, just walking around in, like, school, uh, like, merch. They literally have merch. And then they're like, oh, hello, insert school mascot. Um, isn't it very fun to be ma a mascot? A... Uh, in, our, in my case, the mascot was a breed of dog. They're like, let's go dogs. I don't care. Who cares? Who gives a flick about all of this? Oh, shoot. I shouldn't. They're not low enough. Give me the kills. Yes. Um, who cares? Like, come on. Where is that man? Okay. Where did he come from? Like, there were freshmen, of which I am one of, who were like, go school, go school, I love this school, of which I've only gone to for like, a couple months, and I, I don't know anybody here, but go school, go school, oh my god, I love this school, hashtag dog pride, like, bruh. Who cares? It was the same form. Okay, thank you. Like, how do you get in indoctrinated so quickly? And don't even get me started on the football, American football. Okay, I'm gonna reveal some vital information about my location, but. The local football team is called the Sea Tile Sea Hoax, and by God, are they like people love them for some? It's just a football team. Like, who cares? Most of the players go on and off. They get switched, but you need to love the the twelve. Like, there's. 
Like, because the, the mascot might be a Seahawk, quote-unquote, which I don't think it exists. I mean, it might be the Seagulls. But I don't get... Like, okay, and there's like 12, because a uh, regular football team apparently has four, uh, 11 people. But the fans are the 12th member, and they're like... There's like flags on people's, um, uh, like, porches next to the American flag of the flag of the football team, and let's go. And in second grade, when a guy named Russell Wilson became part of the team, they made us make like those foldable little like box things with his face on it. Like, what the heck? Who cares? Who cares? And also in elementary school is a different school this time. Uh, I tried. Uh, they were like, uh, because of the Super Bowl, because this. Oh no, stank, yeah, stank. I'm gonna head out. Stop! And I think it was in fourth grade. Uh, when the Seahawks made it to the Super Bowl, they made us go into the cafeteria for an assembly in the morning where, like, a bunch of the staff were lined up and they were chanting, Go Hawks! Go Hawks! Go Hawks! Like a bunch of hooligans and wavi waving their arms around like, Oh my god! Who cares? And me and the boys, uh, who loved football, real football, as in the thing that most people in the United States of the A call soccer. Nice job. Uh, we were out in the back just standing there bored out of our minds. Like, we want education, not chanting slogans. Oh, yes. Oh my god, I love strength perk. Did I mention how much I love Strength Park and how it shouldn't be a, how it should definitely be a thing? Like five seconds, be it, make it two seconds, okay, okay. Like, come on. Oh, I love it when I don't get armor in the mid chest. Um, nice. Still no armor. Oh, I got pearls. Nice. I want armor. Let's go. We want armor. Let's go. Hello. I do not want to deal with you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Of course. I can't believe I'm doing this. Material? I'm so good. GG. I don't know how you can become part of an identity that doesn't even matter. Like, a school or a, a, a sports team. Like, it's the same in like England of the... Uh, the soccer teams or football teams or whatever. Goodbye, and they're just. But I mean, I don't get it. Apart from your national identity, how can you have so much pride for something? And I'm like, oh my god, he's a racist, he's anti, he's xenophobic. No, I'm not. Just that people should have pride of who they are, not of what they're a part of. Because you don't matter to the Seahawks or to the Chelsea or Manchester United. But you matter to the people who are next to you, to your family. No, he's gonna have strength, ain't he? Oh, he pulled. What? 
I think the only pride uh, people should have is for their nationality because it's like I do not explain. I'm Romanian, and I'm I'm proud to be a Romanian. What can I say? Like I just don't get how people can be so patriotic for something that doesn't even matter. Like the Seahawks executives or whoever owns it. Like they don't care that you're proud of it. They just care that you buy their own merch. Getting, like all they care about is their bottom line but like your nationality that's like who you are it's, it's like the government I mean maybe in some cases but it's not like the government of your country is using you for profit like I don't live in Romania I live in America but I'm still proud to be Romanian I can't stop that <clears throat> but a loss the, I mean, be proud of what you want but I wouldn't be proud of any sports team oh I got cleaned so cleaned anyways that's my two cents Anyways, yeah, I, I don't get why. How they screwed up so badly on putting the flag of Guinea-Bissau as the only African country on the Parade of Nations banner. Like, hello, Egypt, Nigeria, South Africa, Democratic Republic of the Congo. Ethiopia, you have so many options, and you chose Guinea-Bissau, of course you did. Yeah. Oh, frick. Yeah. I got you. I hope. Like, I don't know what to say. Like, I, I, I want the person from ASB who made that or I don't even know if it was ASB. I mean it probably was shoot. I do not like you being here. Your presence offends me. Give me kill. Give me kill no. Go away. Go away. Yes, okay. I hope you guys liked this video. I don't know if you did, but if you did that that is cool. And if you want to see more commentary videos, as well as other random stuff, I implore you to come and subscribe, maybe. Maybe. Just a thought. I mean, I'm not forcing you to, but it's always there.